Hi. Should we get going with the questions? Yeah, let's get started. This semester, I'm teaching Math 2250, which is discrete mathematics. So this course covers three topics. We do enumerative combinatorics, graph theory, and modular arithmetic. And uh, enumeration is just a fancy way of saying counting. So our first goal is to learn how to count, or rather learn various counting techniques. As a general learning goal uh, for the courses, our students to just recognize the various flavors of problems in discrete math and uh, what tools we can use to uh, solve them. So in terms of formal assessment, there is a pass-fail uh, take-home midterm assignment, and uh, then there's also a final, more traditional final exam. Since uh, the only midway formal assessment that's done is the take-home, I try to give my students lots of feedback and almost always ask for resubmissions. Not because I need the assignments to be perfect, but because this is the kind of only formal time that we have a conversation about their work. To be honest, in the past, they use comparative little, uh, comparatively little digital technology in the classroom. But with uh, the advent of the COVID-19 pandemic, we were forced to make pretty drastic changes. My strategy was to provide a um, screencast, which would take up the time of half of the lecture time. And the second half of each lecture time, we spend meeting on Zoom to discuss and work together. The Zoom features of breakout rooms and the polling to sort of give the students warm-up quizzes have been really effective. Um, in engaging them. So I want to find ways of transferring these back to the physical classroom. In the time waiting for the Zoom sessions to start, uh, we would play some warm-up sessions at the game set. <laughs> so this is a popular card game, but it's also uh, based on affine finite geometries. So this fits into the modular arithmetic section of our course. Conversations with other teachers have been essential to developing teaching. So, uh, for example, this course, Math 2250, is a brand new course and uh, wouldn't have been possible without the conversations with other faculty members or things like content and um, strategy and how it fits into the other learning programs. Other more local things about the course, so for example, in coming up with uh, the assignments and exams, uh, it's always good to run these by other teachers and uh, certainly with the COVID changes it was very important to be able to talk to each other to uh, discuss what strategies for online learning were effective. <laughs>